What is happening YouTube? I'm at Carter's Lake. Yeah, I drove all the way up here and uh, I got lost a bunch of times. But uh, yeah, I'm at the overpass up here at the top, you know. And I thought I'd show you guys what it looks like up here at the top. You know, the overlook. But yeah, I got lost quite a bit. And I, I went by uh, GPS and Google Maps. The, you know, so... <laughs> I was going crazy trying to get up here, but I found it, and I got up here, so, yeah, out of my comfort zone, I'm telling you, I'm at the overlook, so, yeah, there's like a little spot for an overlook, and there's like a little thing right here, I don't know if you can see the thing, but yeah, that's where I'm at, so, I'm just going to pan out and around, and you guys can see, I mean, you know, but yeah, I'm way up here. And I'm just walking around the building right now. Okay, guys? So, you can see it in the back of me here. But yeah, that's where I'm at here. And check it out. It's nice up here. Totally nice. And like I said, I got lost a bunch of times. And there's like a little, you know, on the top of the over, overlook here, um, there's like a plaque that tells you about stuff. And... This is just like a little area inside here. I'm trying to pan out and show you, but it's kind of difficult. But yeah, because you know, I'm on my phone. But yeah, it's like a little gazebo kind of thing. And you can overlook at the top. If you could look in the background, that's where I'm at. Yeah, I thought I'd make it interesting for you guys. And I thought this is an awesome location to take you guys, you know. Because I really want to go places and do my videos in different areas, you know? And uh, even if, you know, I'm trying with the content, you know? I'm trying to make as much of it as I can to make it different. So, so I'm not always preaching, you guys. And, uh, yeah. Uh, yeah, they got, you know, it's just a little rest area on the top. It's got a little water fountain and everything. And steps. But I want to I want to be able to take you guys out in places and do things, you know. And there's a nature trail here too, but I'll have to lock up my Jeep and everything. I can't leave it unlocked, you know. Cause, well, I should go do that now. But I wanted to show you guys first, okay? And then we'll go and look at the overpass here. But yeah, I'm going to go lock my Jeep up because, you know, I don't want to be wandering off and then forget to lock my jeep and then come back and i have to walk all the way home and it's like oh, a couple hours so yeah i went out of my comfort zone guys so yeah uh make sure everything's locked up you know because i leave everything open all the time uh, so just bear with me for one second guys Just one second, guys. All right. I really don't have anything of value in there. Um, wait a minute. I gotta do this, or my alarms are gonna go off. Uh, I know it's it's a hassle, but I gotta do it. Uh, so just hang in there with me, and we'll go check it out. Okay. We got it locked up. That's done with. But yeah, guys, I hope you enjoy it. You know, I try to make the content as nice as I can. You know, I'm panning out for you. I know you're getting dizzy, but yeah, we'll, we'll check it out. But I just thought it'd be something different that I can do my videos on, you know. And not all the time preach my lessons because I've pretty much gone through all my lessons I want to go through, go through right now. So I'm just going to try to take you scenic places you know and we'll explore together because it's been a lot of a long time since I ever been up here so in some areas I haven't even been to so if you look there's quite a drop off behind me take the next left onto Carter's Dam Road uh, sorry about that is GPS thing going off because I'm using the GPS for my uh yeah, you understand. But 
look at that drop off guys it is extreme you yeah, see there's the overlook thing it's right in back of me that's the big lake in back of me but uh, uh yeah like I said sometimes you got to get out of your comfort zone and see there's the dam overlook on well you can't see it but there's a dam overlook over the top, the visitor center, and then it goes to Acorn Trail and back down to the overlook. I don't know if I want to go that far down, but uh, we can just get some views over here, you know, just check it out. But yeah, <clears throat> I don't know how good I'm in, uh, good I am for for hiking a trail, you know, out of the comfort zone of my. But if you look at behind me that is just awesome it's an awesome view up here it was worth the drive and getting lost and everything you know um i'll show you more but if you look behind me it's just one big lake guys and there's a bunch of nature trails and everything and you know uh, woods and stuff and lots of nature around here so you can definitely get lost up in here and me you know i'm always like <laughs> in my room so guys this is like this is crazy it's just you know way out of my comfort zone but I'm trying to do it for the viewers make better content for you guys you know and have you entertained because that's what it's all about guys you know and uh, they got these little signs posted on the on the trail so you can check them out but I, I'm not gonna read them all I just want you to experience everything and look around but yeah I think this is a very nice scenic route, but yeah, I'm going to try and check it out, you know, guys, but yeah, but you know, like I said, I look for snakes, poison ivy, all that good stuff, but you know, there's a lot of pretty vegetation around, but there is poison ivy and stuff too, so, you know, I'll, I'll probably go back and have it, but <laughs> anyways, I digress, but you know, they got these old trees, you know, they got the stuff, and you can look around, and it's very scenic and very nice, you know. It's amazing. And it was well worth the, the you know, the hike up here, and the, well, not the hike, but the drive. And I was so nervous, and I, I was going all over the place getting lost. You would not believe how many times I got lost coming up here. Yeah. And going home, I don't know. Yeah, it might be another thing too. But I made it, guys. You know, that's what's awesome. You know, hopefully, you know, everything's good and Gucci. But yeah. But it's it's a pretty day, you know. It's very nice. Oh my goodness. I don't know if you can see the lake in in between the trees, but it's like I'm on the nature walk. The little the nature trail that goes up yeah that's what I'm doing guys <clears throat> and I just hope this is interesting to you guys you know it's something I've, I've been wanting to do you know just like the red clay video and all the other videos I try to better each one you know and like I said they got like artificial nesting structures for like the birds and the wildlife and stuff you know and they have them all up in the trees I don't know if you can see them yeah right there but they got them everywhere and they got stuff for nature and you know the animals and stuff so yeah but it's just awesome guys this is definitely a nature trail more than the other one you know more than my little fishing spot one but yeah uh, it feels good today the air is good like I said, I'm not taking the mask off or nothing, but just walking around, doing a little nature walk, I guess. But yeah, and I'll pan out so you can see around me. Just one good shot, you know, and it just goes all the way around. Yeah, back of. <laughs> I'm tickled, guys. I really am. Just to know where I'm at, you know, and know I did it by myself. Yeah. 
like I said, you, you know, I have to get out of my comfort zone to do these videos. And these videos really help me, you know. It really makes it uh, rewarding to me as a person, you know, as a creator. Um, and you can see the moss on the ground and stuff. I don't know if that's what it's called, but it's interesting, guys. It really is. But yeah. And you can see, you know, there's people around here, but, uh, you know, it's they're sparsely around. So, I mean, it's an awesome location, though, guys. And if you get a chance, you should really, you know, get out and do something, you know. Um, yeah. But uh, I don't know if I want to go all the way down there. It's quite a walk, you know, <laughs> then I got to walk all the way back, but, uh, yeah, so I'm just gonna, I don't know, man, I, <laughs> viewers, I'm sorry, not man, but men, women, friends, children, yeah, ah, I don't know if I should go all the way down or not, hmm, because if you look, if you look, there is quite a, Quite a walk, you know, guys. Quite a walk, and it would definitely be a while. So I might have to just uh, just walk back up and uh, drive down there, you know, because I don't want to have to walk like ten miles back to the car, you know, or whatever. So I'm just gonna go back up here, and then you know, I'll probably move in different locations i have to think about stuff before i do them because if not i'll get stranded and i don't want to get stranded anywhere you know even though it's quite possible i'll get stranded up here but <laughs> it's okay guys but yeah and even though you know i just made that little short walk it, it goes way down there so you know and i'm walking this is you see what i'm walking on right guys it's not a paved road all trails so it's an exciting adventure and like I say when you get out of your comfort zone you know you'll be amazed at the stuff you find it's always the journey and not the destination you know yeah that's what life's about guys sometimes you just got to go against your fear and just go for it you know run with it because if you always stay scared all the time, you'll never experience what there is in life. And there is a whole world outside what you think there is, you know? Because it's all about perspective. You know, it's, it's all about getting out there and doing things. You know? I know there's always a, a fear about what other people think, but... There's also a fear of the unknown and doing things that are way out of your comfort zone. Uh, yeah, this is definitely way out there for me. But you know, I did it and it's an accomplishment. You know, it's something I'm proud of. And it seems I've had a lot of accomplishments and things I'm not proud of, you know. Uh, and a lot of them relate to this channel because I go out of that comfort zone to make these videos because you know every place I go to is a different location and I experience a lot you know a personal growth and at my age it's kind of crazy you know it's taken me this long to figure things out you know and that's why I do these videos too is for you guys so you won't take 50 years to learn all these lessons you know even though I've raised my children and taught them things um, <laughs> I'm learning still every day you know and it's amazing the stuff I learn okay guys <clears throat> I'll give you one more walk around here and you can check it out uh, motorcycle guys but that's cool we love motorcycles too you know but anyways guys 
yeah check it out I, uh, I'm back up here at the overlook because I wasn't gonna walk all the way down to the trail I, I mean I could but like I said I'd have to hike up back to get my car or my Jeep <sighs> What do you think, guys? Something you want to do? Just get out and do it, guys. You know, don't be scared. Don't pe let people dictate what you do, and don't let the fear with inside you stop you. You know, sometimes you got to face your fears head on, like I said, and do things out of your comfort zone. You know, it'll enrich your life. Okay, guys? So if you like my video, please like, comment, and subscribe. Hit the notification bell if you so choose. And as always, my friends, peace out, bro. Yeah, peace out. Yeah.